the difference between me and a lot of these fighters, they don't get better. We've only gotten better because I was born for this. I was made for this. Those fighters, they're talented, but they're not God gifted. Let's get this party started. This is boxing. This is top rank. The takeover is trying to take back. Tiafimo Lopez will return to the ring. This kid's gonna come back with vengeance on his mind, no doubt about it. They're coming for him because they see blood in the water, and I wanna see Team Lopez's response to what they're dealing with. We took over 135, now we're on our way to take over 140. Let's get it, baby. It's not the takeover anymore, it's the take back, and then he's gonna take over again at 140. So first he takes it back, then he takes it off. <laughs> yeah? What are we doing, what are we doing here, Teofimo? Yeah. We taking over. <laughs> Could take back. We in that. We love to be working with Tio Fimo. I think we share a lot of the same values. So right now we're doing some signatures. We're gonna do some giveaways. Really putting the fans first. So when he wins, the fans are gonna win. Even a free beer giveaway after he knocks out his opponent this fight. Just doing things like this is what really matters, you know. At the end of it, when I'm in there in the gym, I'm having a great time. That's my. It's what I love to do. But over here, you know, it's just all about giving back. Just stay tuned, man. You guys can win one of these too. One of these bad boys. You know, let's go Bud Light. Let's go team. Timo Lopez is the charm. He's uh, he's actually known me since I was like seven, eight years old. Yeah. Uh, funny thing, man. I used to be with Shannon Briggs in the warehouse, right? And we used to. Uh, That's when I really started like taking it serious. Just growing up in that environment you know, really instilled a lot in me. We got Jorge Rubio, assistant coach, and uh, the man that's trained with Rick and Diao, the man that's trained with a lot of champions uh, throughout his past time. So it's just, it's great to have him around as well. You know, um, he's known me as well since a young kid, and I've always come to his gym, spar his champions, spar his pros, uh, spar his fighters, and you know, I learned a thing or two from them too. So, you know, we got Muhammad Ali, he just was so comfortable, always comfortable, no matter what was around him. Always flowed with it, he rhymed with it, it was just perfect, and it was always on good time, and, and no one could ever do it like him. No one should. Bobby, go here, when you go here, go top two. And then straight right hand. Yeah. Give me this, give me this. Tell me. Beautiful. Ooh, nice. Yeah. Like when he throws the right, chant. When he throws the right, back We ready, man. August 13, you already know, man. The comeback. It was, it was a takeover, now it's a take back. So, you know, we're coming back. Big fight. Hopefully everything goes right and uh, we fight again in December. Like a champ, feel like a champ. You know, the greatest. Hey, I'm the best. Forget the rest. You no, know, the first, the first day we, uh, the first day he started hitting this bag, he just ripped it all apart, man. <laughs> Campa on the 13th, man, what we doing? I really want to express all my skill sets, you know, and see how much this guy can take from me and how much he can't take from me. So, you know, that's what people don't understand. We don't go in there for the knockout. We always go, we go there to box. What I pushed for, what I did with Loma, all that other stuff, they think that was it. That was the best that he saw of me. I'm truly excited for this fight because it's going to show, like, that was just the beginning of me. This was, the difference between me and a lot of these fighters, they don't get better. They still fight the same. We've only gotten better because I was born for this.
Because I've been cooking the whole entire camp for them, you know, breakfast, lunch, snacks. I enjoy it. They know where everything's coming from. I know where everything's coming from. So that helps out. It's good. It's good. Different, different variety, easy day. Something different. <laughs> Not the same sit over and over again. Definitely, definitely a 10 out of 10. <laughs> Y'all want work in Madden, man? Hit me up. Duke, um, Dash, JSM. I want 2K with it, man. I don't be, I don't be playing people though, man. But chilling. No little uniform. Sneak peek right there. If I get in January, I did the the brown chinchilla for you know. Can I may want me to do the whole thing again? So. It's been, it's been training with literally right next door to you. Oh, yeah. it's, been, it's been good, man. You know, it's definitely good to have had somebody, you know, to be able to push you. Just having an extra push there makes you work a little harder. And then, you know, at the same time, you know, if you're doing something wrong, you watch him do it. Maybe he's doing it right. So, you know, you just learn off each other. It's definitely good to have a, a brother there next to you. We done did training camps together since we were professionals, but it'd be like, Usually, like, I fight this week, he fight the next week or something like that, but we're on the same car, so it was good to have a guy here that I, you know, grew, grew with as far as, like, skill-wise, condition-wise, mm. mentally-wise, you know, maturity-wise, so now we got to put it together in the ring. Back in Vegas, back in business, I'm happy, I'm excited. We got the whole team with us, ready to put on a show Saturday night. It's been a long time coming, um, eight weeks of, of great camp after, you know, after having to cancel the last fight. So um, I'm just excited. I'm excited. I'm happy and just blessed to be here today. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Good luck. Right. Have a good night. Camp was great. You know, had both the boys in camp together, so it was, uh, it was nice to kill two birds with one stone. You know, they did well, trained hard. You know. uh, it's been great training with Xander. Uh, every day we're in the gym together, he's pushing me, trying to get better. Um, you know, and it, it's great that we're both on the same car, so we both just had the same schedule throughout the whole thing. The schedule was just the same because we had the same fight, we had the, the same day, so we we were in the same meals, same training camp. I mean, everything was was just the same. Um, obviously, you know, with the opponents' difference, we we changed a bit of that, but overall. We were pushing each other to the limits every single time, every single day. And um, I feel like we, we have something to prove this Saturday night. We have a lot to prove. We have to, we have to show the world that, that we've improved, that we've gotten better, and that we're coming for everybody. Vegas, we're here. Don't miss it. ESPN Plus and ESPN, August 13th.